going to talk about now is sidewall removal. Basically, when we remove sidewall, what we're doing is getting a piece of the sidewall out of the way so that we can actually get to our edge and do the sharpening of it. Usually, it's a brand new ski that we're going to work on initially. The important thing about a sidewall plane is that you have a bit. It doesn't have any cracks or chips in it. It can be round. It can be square. It can be made of molded, ejected, plastic, or it can be out of stainless steel like this one is. This is the Sun Valley Ski Tools World Cup sidewall plane. What we want to do is we want to use this heel piece and we want to put it on the base of the ski. Now, I've already set this up on the ski so that it has the right amount of depth to cut out the sidewall. In the sidewall, and we'll give you a closer look, but there's two actually two layers that you want to get rid of. You want to get rid of this plastic and you also want to get rid of that extra little metal layer that's right there to get to your side edge. We're going to place it right at the tip we're going to start there, and we're going to start making nice, fluid strokes. And what we're doing is we're removing that sidewall material to get to the edge. We don't want to use our files for removing sidewall material. We want to use a carbide bit. We're going to work the whole length of the ski. So what we're doing here is we're applying even pressure, letting the carbide bit do the cutting action for you. As you can see with the pieces that are rolling out from underneath the blade, this is removing that sidewall material and that thin layer of metal that is above the side edge. These are the pieces that you want to remove so that you get an unabated piece of that side edge to sharpen and put it the degree that you'd like. As you can see, when you do it correctly, you get nice fine filings. You get a nice fine filings that come off of that. Very important. Many times I'll see sidewall planes with the bits actually facing the other direction, meaning that this will be turned down and be used more like a skiver. That's not what we want to use the tool as. This is a carbide bit. It's much sharper and stronger than any piece of material that's on this sidewall. As a finishing tech tip for doing sidewall planning and also finish work on your skis, use either a panzer file or a strawberry file to finish the top sheet off. What I mean by finishing the top sheet off, I mean round it out, making it smoother. If it's a very abrupt edge, it's easy for two skis to get hooked to each other, especially when you're dealing with sharp race skis. What I want to do is place this on the ski, kind of at a 45, but in a rounding motion, we want to start removing this upper sheet, top sheet, and rounding it into the sidewall. It's going to make a very nice, rounded, easy, supple piece to your ski. Now that makes a very nice round piece, but for that really nice finishing touch, we want to use just a piece of 220 carbide paper, silicone carbide, and just rub it right there on the edge. That's going to smooth it out to perfection and really leave you a nice finished product.